5, the New Orleans Inspector General says the NOPD is mishandling some of its payroll and pay detail policies with some officers double dipping. The findings come in a recently released audit, but the chief says some are off base. WDSU News reporter Travers Mackle live in studio with the very latest. Travers? Camille, the chief says the IG audited the books at the busiest time in the history of the NOPD, and he's questioning some of the findings. In early 2013, the city's police department was busy handling the Super Bowl and Mardi Gras. But that's the time frame selected by New Orleans Inspector General Ed Quatrevo for his new audit on the NOPD. Superintendent Ronald Surpass questions the dates chosen. The time frame that the Inspector General chose to look at, which is his choice, was the busiest time in the history of the New Orleans Police Department. The audit found that 14 officers worked more than the 32 hours of overtime allowed in a week. Paid details were not properly documented or approved according to department policy. Three officers worked a total of four paid details during assigned NOPD shifts. And 12 officers worked 50 paid details without a break between their regular shift and their detail. Inspector General Ed Quatrevo said NOPD supervisors must effectively monitor officers' time to be sure officers get the proper rest required to avoid fatigue related accidents and poor work performance. Superintendent Serpes says the time frame led to some of the problems detailed by Quatrevo. But what about one night when the parades came late and everybody had to stay? I mean, is this the circumstance of a heart surgeon saying, wait, I'm stopping the surgery. I got off at five. I can't go no more. I mean, there's going to be some examples where officers may not have done what they were supposed to do. There's going to be examples where supervisors said, look, Paul, you can't get off right now. I know you work 16 and a half hours, but that parade is still on a street corner and you can't go anywhere yet. It could be that as well. We'll get to the bottom of it. A surpass also says many of the payroll problems have been addressed since the city moved to a new payroll system. It is a far better way to manage payroll and monitor payroll. This report comes from the IG, who in the past has been plagued by payroll issues inside his own department. In 2012, the city's civil service department investigated Quatrevo's office for allegations that he improperly changed an employee's time card who worked in the police monitor's office. Scott?